Hi guys, good afternoon. Right now it's about 1.30 p.m. and today is 16th of January 2018. How's everything? How's it going? Today is actually, see the end face is red. Flips carbon down. Jufik Bio down. Reliance Capital down. Sale down. Idea down. Advanced Insight Bombay down. You know, we, I mean, you have to be protecting you will have to protect your positions you know when that you can only do when you understand the market's direction so i am little on you know the three days are passive side you know like i'm not we're not giving more trades right now because there has to be a profit booking there must be a profit booking that now see this is nifty nifty let me show you from 15 minutes first this is how nifty, so nifty opened above the pivot point hold itself right it tried to hold itself for quite some time and did hold for good one and a half hour right then it broke the pivot point with volumes that was first indication nifty plans to go down that was first indication that the nifty plans to go down then it went down took a support went up but again it could not cross the pivot point right and now it has broken even the s1 right so this is a good indication you know when the nifty goes down when nifty goes down good stocks will be available for you you know now there is some kind of you know um, profit booking should be there in the market now otherwise you know a market it will become very very overvalued market if there is no profit booking now see across the space heg goa carbon and look into wipro no wipro is up i traded in wipro today just dial is up right but look into all of this all other stocks you know you talk about tcs all the it stocks are up today if anything that is holding market today because it's because of you know it look at tcs heading up look at infi it is heading up look at hcl tech it is heading up wipro i traded in it heading up all stocks are really really doing good today right so if you understand the direction of the market you understand you know where do you need to book your profit now people those who have got good money out of flips carbon it's time for you to exit and again wait for it to come to a support right again wait for see it is it is you know actually yesterday only we should have booked our profits or the day before right once this candle was formed nifty was lifetime high that's the time we need to book our profit and as i told you if nothing else convert this into high kanishi and see here first doji the day first red, red doji forms that's the indication today it's a clear exit today it's a clear exit let's see what's happening in goa carbon let's see what's happening in goa carbon there is doji here can you see this green doji right and today it's a flat uh, head red candle means clear sign for us to exit heg heg still not a sign of exiting right heg doesn't have the sign of exiting today so the which stock has had the biggest you know fall it is the federal bank look at federal bank today how did it fall it has just had this massive fall and see it's 15 minutes graph it's a nice 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 downfall and the trade that we traded in the morning rather i did it with the entire class of mine was apollo tires we traded into apollo tires this is the beautiful run-up apollo tires has given my members have traded into hindalco and vedl right they have traded into these trades beautiful trades no ambiguity just pure clarity with this they have traded right so if you want to do these kind of trades if you want to trade in such kind of with such kind of certainty in intraday you have to learn about it you have to learn about it and we are starting our january's hindi session on this saturday so guys if you are wanting to be in the market and you want to know when to enter when to exit 
you know, very, very clear entry. For us, Apollo Tire, where did we enter into it? We entered when the scandal was formed, right? But how do you decide that this is the stock I want to enter? So there are ways and methods that we teach you, right? There are ways and methods that we teach you. And this is what you see coming up, right? And uh, so what is going to be in February, uh, the January 2nd webinar that we are doing, it's going to be the Hindi webinar. It is going to be a webinar conducted in purely Hindi for everybody who wants to understand stock market in Hindi in simple terms. And second thing about it will be that we will be doing intraday, right? We will be doing intraday that will be from February onwards a separate case, separate course. Intraday will be separate and positional will be separate. So I would request you all, if you want to understand with in one go, please register ASAP because the seats are getting filled up, right? So Nifty is again trying to take a support. So a little bit up and down, up and down will continue, right? But let's see. I expect a bit more profit booking to definitely come in, right? I expect a bit more profit booking to definitely come in. So let's see. Let's see its option chain. What's happening in the options? And probably options will tell us what's happening here. So there is a call writing happening at 400, uh, at 10,700 level, right? And the put writing is actually comparably less. If you see, if you compare the call writing and the put writing, put writing is lesser in compared to the call writing, right? So Nifty definitely looks weak to me and I believe it's overdue. It's overdue. Like see here, since when market started going up, 6th of December, it's been good almost one and a half month market has been going up. So it has to, there has to be some kind of profit booking, you know, some kind of this kind of a step has to form. Otherwise, uh, you know, like this gap becomes very, makes, tells me that though there's a huge gap between 10 moving average and the price. And that makes market very, very vulnerable, right? So you have to be careful now. You have to protect your capital, right? And if you have stocks which have been running for the past one month or two months or three months, time to exit or hold your positions with stop losses. So I want to show you what I traded today. I traded the three trades, one in Lu Wipro, the other in Lupin, and the next one in Apollo Tires. So Wipro, what did I do? I entered from, I entered at this point. You can see the line that I've drawn. That is where I entered and I exited right here. On the next pivot point is where I exited it here. The second trade that I did was Apollo tires. And where did I enter into Apollo tire? I, ex I entered right at this point and I took two points. Like exactly at the same point that, that I'm telling you, when this candle started forming, Marubuzu candle, I entered here. One point was my stop loss and two point was my target. Risk to reward ratio was... 1 is to 2, right? So these were my trades today. And now I'm waiting. You know, if, if some correction takes place, I will get good stocks on a reasonable value. Otherwise, see see the India glycol, how much today it's just been in a free fall. So good idea is to keep booking your profits. Keep booking your profits. And as I told you, market works in both the direction. So we shorted today Apollo tires. Right, my members shorted VEDL and Hindalco. So, trade, you know, like what many of my members have done, they have mastered one or two trades, just one or two trades. And in that, they get almost 10K every day. It's a huge amount. It's a huge amount from any angle. So, do that way. You know, like you can master just one trade and you can trade it in its future or you can trade, but I, I would say that. Without learning, don't trade in anything. Until you understand the market, don't do anything. Okay. So uh, uh, now, you know, I don't know. Um, I Did I tell you EIH hotels? I gave EIH hotels at what cost? I gave it at, 
EIH hotels here. Can you see 12, 12? And then 12, 12, we gave it at what position did I give it to you? 150. We said buy it at 150. And today, where is it today? Today, it even touched 230. It touched 230. So 80 points in one and a half months, not even one and a half months, one month. Good about 50% return. Good about 50% return in one month. Where do you get such kind of returns? Right? These are huge returns. If you would have invested one lakh, it would have become one and a half lakh for you right now. This is the magnanimity. These are the enormous returns you get. But the only thing is people don't need know where to enter, where to exit, which stock to enter, when to enter, when to exit. These are phenomenal returns. You know, if you have 2 lakh rupees, it's good 1 lakh rupees doing nothing. These guys, EI Hotel is working for you. EI Hotels are working for you. You don't need to do anything. They are working for you day and night so that you have good profits, right? So these are the earn. This is these kind of returns you can only get it in uh, stock market. But the only thing that you have to do is understand the market direction of the market, right? It's not by somebody has told you the market. You know, yesterday I was telling one of my members he now has consistent profit about ten to twenty thousand rupees every day, and I was telling him why is it so? Because he has stopped asking others when to enter, when to exit. When you stop doing that, look at VEDL. What a beautiful fall today. When you stop asking people when to enter, when to exit, you are in command of your money. And that is where your journey, beautiful journey in stock market begins. That is where you start earning money. Become the master of your money than anyone else. And that is why I so much always talk about doing understanding the market and uh, doing trade trading yourself all right so these are some of the stocks so now i was thinking you know for the next uh, i mean i'm not getting time otherwise if i get some more uh, leisure time i would like to do step by step the commodity trading trading i want to trade with you guys commodity in, in trading uh, in uh, trading in commodity i want to teach you I want to go step by step or maybe tomorrow onwards i start a series with step by step teaching in commodity right and i'll tell you tomorrow what all commodities we will be trading in so we're going to build up the blocks one after the other uh, and how do we see what do we see what are the parameters to look into everything we'll do about you know um, about uh, commodity trading so two three commodities that we'll look into one is crude, the other is gold, and nickel and aluminium. These are the three, four things. And even I was thinking natural gas. We'll see. Three, four, five commodities we'll try to master. Right? So we will build up the series one after the other, one after the other, so that you can all uh, you know, understand commodity training, trading because many of you trade in commodities. So uh, I'm planning to build up the series slowly gradually because that will be a little deviation from nifty but we i definitely want to do that as well okay so as i have told you for commodity i definitely want you guys to have you know um, i want you to find out go to the gci i want you to definitely go to gci you must all be downloading gci so that we can analyze from there right so here is you know nifty once again before we close it definitely looks to me under pressure it falls then a bit of profit booking then again if it breaks this pivot point further fall can be expected and i'm i definitely feel there should be weakness in the nifty all right so this is what i wanted to share guys and no new stocks because i just want to sit aside and watch market for a few days right i want to sit aside and watch the market for a few days because market may correct because people will book profit and once i find the stocks on a good reasonable valuation we may enter again 
we may enter again but for the next i i will see the correct reversal sign in nifty if i get so or i get a stock which is really really doing well i may be giving it otherwise i want to watch market now right when there is a such a time we learn new things right when the market is running up run with the market when the market is correcting either be on the sell side or learn new things polish your skills so we will be doing we will be polishing our skills right so that is what i plan for you that we will start working on commodity slowly gradually we will build it up see even jvl agro is down today everything is down today right all the stocks are down today so keep protecting your your capital and book your profit or if you're a long term investor then forget about it right you don't need to worry if you are a long term investor you don't need to worry about it just hold your stocks and or if you still feel exit you can enter again on a lower valuations because right now market is very very heavily overbought bye bye good day see you see you at my webinar and see you tomorrow as well so use the opportunity the beautiful part of our training is that we ensure that you get your money back right the beautiful part of our uh, our training program is that you get your money back that is what we promise you which no other trainer in the market does that's the confidence i have in my teaching that you will be able to recover whatever is your investment in the market through training with trading with us all right good day see you tomorrow and also see you on this saturday for our hindi webinar bye bye